Welcome to another Burn Tables demo. Today I want to show you how to set up um, a separate layer so you can engrave on something you want to cut out. And I'm going to open up a new drawing, go over to the rectangle, and of course you always have to view zoom all. And there's my square, and um, I want to go ahead and add some text that I'll engrave. And I'm going to use stencil text and engraver. Okay, okay, and of course it's going to be really large. So the first thing I want to do is scale it. I'm going to do five inches and five inches since my square is six by six. Okay, and then I'm going to highlight it and move it up. Okay, make it a little bigger so I can see it. And I'm going to explode the text. And then the next thing I need to do is that more modify join, more modify regions. And make sure they're all in the same layer right now because I haven't created a new layer. Okay, so I'm good to go to create a layer. I go to Layer Manager right here and Create. And I'm going to create a layer called Text. Okay, then I'm going to select what I want to put on that text layer. Right click, Change Layer, and just as easy as that. Okay, now I'm going to export this to a DXF file and I'm going to call it ENG1. Okay, and go over to my machine software and I've already got an engraver set up and I've also got some torches. So I'm going to import my drawing, make sure that I got all the lines and those sorts of things. There it is. Okay, it looks good. It's all red. There's no long white lines, so that means I don't have broken lines. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to set up my operations. And the first thing I want to do is set the engraver up. No offset. Put that on the text layer. Make sure it's the engraver. 50 inches per minute is good. No lead in and no lead out because it comes right down on top of it. And it's going to light up and show me that I've selected uh, the engraved part of this piece. And you want to have your engraver set up to operate before the torch, otherwise you cut out the piece before you engrave it. So now I can add the torch. Okay, and I'll do outside offset default. You see that light up. And um, I'm going to use this plasma torch and make that 120 inches per minute. Go back to arc and arc and OK. And it lights up green. OK, so you know that you're set up um, to engrave and then to cut out. OK, I hope you've enjoyed this burn tables demo.